people make too much of taking your clothes off. And I think if more people took their clothes off in public, they would realize how, um, how unimportant it is. The first time I did it, which was when I was modeling, I was terrified. I was like, oh my God, you know, the entire world will come to the end when my shirt comes off. But that's really not true, you know, at all. And, and nothing really changes by doing it. What's most interesting about burlesque is not that you're taking your top off, it's that you're being applauded. You can put on, you know, a corset and sequins and suddenly you're an entirely different person. And it, it gives you a kind of courage and power. It's only, almost like you're channeling something. You take normal, everyday women and put them in the dressing room and you add some feathers, some sequins, some creativity, some confidence, and they come out as goddesses on stage. The reason that burlesque influences my art so much is because I'm very, very interested in artifice. And I feel like burlesque is artifice really used to its best possible extent. I'm an illustrator, which in the art world is very much equivalent to whore. My aesthetic is kind of like, um, where's Waldo for perverts? Like this kind of explosion of detail with all sorts of horrifying things hidden inside it. I draw everything from, I don't know, um, Rococo aristocrats to uh, scheming society matrons to uh, giant orgies of donkeys and elephants meant to reflect our primary season. Without further ado, our beautiful model, the gorgeous Delirium Tremens, as the Green Fairy. <laughs> Dr. Sketchies is what happens when Cabaret meets art school. We take uh, some sort of glamorous performer model, a circus performer, a drag queen, a burlesque dancer. We put them in an elaborately dressed set. We put them in an environment where there's free-flowing booze. We bring in a bunch of artists to draw them. We believe in celebrating the personalities of our models. In a typical art class, the model is there to, uh, to demonstrate the latissimus dorsi, to demonstrate how a wrist connects into an arm. Our models are there to demonstrate a fantastic, glamorous personality. I guess my New York is really the New York of people who kind of live off the grid. People who don't have day jobs. People who don't go out during the day. People who are cabaret performers at night. Or artists. Or people who kind of make their living by their wits. I think that those are the most interesting type of people. People who never made their compromises with the silly corporate world. So I'd say that that was, that was my New York. Oh,